last year played out against a fast-changing global landscape. With the international energy crisis looming large in the headlines, Apito continued to develop a safe and skilled energy workforce, with over 450,000 people trained to Apito standards. Eight new training centers opened, 16 new global qualifications launched, seven new standards introduced, over 70 new approvals granted to our network of existing centers. We supported our approved training centers in an increasingly digital world, putting the hub at the center of a risk-based approach, designed to improve user experience and introducing revised processes to support collaborative relationships with our partners and learners. And we continue to support industry with the training it needs, introducing seven new standards and responding to demand in key areas where the need was greatest, while also offering our certificate extension scheme when necessary. Across the 12 months, we launched a total of 23 new products including an innovative suite of energy transition qualifications. And to meet the commitments in the North Sea Transition Deal, we launched the Integrated People and Skills Strategy, a blueprint for developing the all-energy workforce, which is now driving development of a cross-industry energy skills passport. Elsewhere, we look to recruit the next generation to deliver net zero, with over 240 apprentices currently enrolled onto the OGTAP scheme and future energy leaders being inspired through My Energy Future, which included live events, including our first in Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia, and continuing partnerships, including those with science centres in Glasgow and Aberdeen. And we worked hard to bring all our global stakeholders together, not least with the return of our annual Apito Global event after a two-year hiatus, which saw over 360 delegates join us over two days in Kuala Lumpur. Finally, throughout the year, we continue to build a high-performing team, and in recognition of our efforts, our Investors in People certification in the UK was raised to gold level. Now, as one very successful year concludes, we're looking to the future with highlights in 2023 set to include the launch of the revised APITO delivery and assessment policy, the next stage of the hub to streamline registration and certification, and the introduction of our online open learning exams. As the energy transition continues at pace, 2023 will be another busy and productive year for APITO, our network of approved centres and learners. Watch this space.